I'm Fernando de Castro. I come from the, the country where the, the stars begin. You know, oh, in Congo, okay. you can be poor, you got nothing, but you need you to have a suit <laughs> a star. So welcome to the Castro business. It's my pleasure. Okay, it's I'm my so, pleasure to be here. I'm so thankful. Yeah. So as I promised you, I'm mm. gonna give you a suit custom by us. Wow. Okay. So let wow. me bring you. Okay. Let me for you, and then we're gonna start later. Okay. I'm excited. Well, so um, as I told you earlier, I'm here with Fernando Castell. Um, he. This is as you can see around. I don't have to explain. There are suits everywhere. It's not just suits. There are ties. There are shoes. You know, the place is well branded. And then as I started, he said he's going to give me a suit. So I'm excited for my suit. Let's see what he has for me. So what do you have for me? So I got you the suit here, mm. as you can see. So you got the Castro here. Okay. Fernando de Castro. Fernando de Castro. Where like you feel it. Okay. So okay. let me open it. Yeah. So actually, it's like a dark green suit. Okay. So, okay. So it looks smart. Wow. And then we're going to continue to... Wow. Okay. <laughs> so... I like this, <laughs> guys. <laughs> look at this. This is this is wonderful. You're doing a great job. So you can see here. So we put the red. Yeah. So we put the red here. So you can find the castle. This red. When you're gonna wear them with the, the formal shoes. So like the red gonna be the red button. Oh. So okay. it's gonna match when you open it like this. And it's people see. Wow. Yes, wow. So match. So wear them and then we're gonna continue. Okay. Right. I'll be right back then. <laughs> Right, so uh, as you can see, I'm all suit up, uh, custom and designed by Fernando De Castro. Fernando De Castro. Fernando yeah. De Castro. Fernando De Castro. <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah, Fernando De Castro. So I hope you guys can check me out. This is made, and it's amazing. This brother is right here in Beijing, and he's doing wonderfully well creating all these things. So now we are ready for our interview. I want you to get to know him more. So we'll start with his name and where he comes from. Okay, uh, I'm Fernando de Castro. Mm. So uh, I come from Congo. Mm. I've been in China for a long time here, like almost uh, six years. Wow. So the idea to start the business mm. was like about four years ago. Mm. Uh, I was thinking about to make something different to these days. Oh, okay. So that we're going to talk about in deeper later. Sure, sure. So you sure. already know where I'm from. So sure. like I come from the the country where the, the stars begin. So they call it like Congo and Congo Brazza and Congo Kinshasa. Oh, okay. So those people, mm. they're born for the start of the suit. You know, oh, in Congo, okay. you can be poor, you got nothing, but you need you to have a suit, a star. <laughs> wow. So that, that inspiration, yeah. so we work about this every day, every day, mm. every day, me and my partner, uh, okay. actually his name is uh, Cleo. You. So like next time, uh, I'm gonna introduce him. Okay. So every day we work about to make something new. Okay. Yeah. We'll talk more about that. Yeah. But you said something about the style mm -hmm. and the culture of the Congolese people. Yeah. So it means that when you were home, mm -hmm. you were already, you know, doing something about styling or doing suits. Were you doing something before coming to China? So like, uh, I remember when I was uh, 14. Mm. So I was like suit so much. Mm. So I even bought my grandpa suit. I even have the photo. Wow. My grandpa <laughs> suit. So the suit was so, so big. big on me <laughs> like this. But that that from that I got that inspiration like I need to wear suit. I need to make something mm. suit. Mm. I need to design suit. Mm. I need to sell suit. Mm. And then I got chance to be here and then I start. Yeah, start. Yeah. yeah. So the idea to make a suit started from four years ago, right? Idea to make suit started for four years ago, but the idea to wear suit mm. it started like for a long time ago. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So when you started over here, um, did you have like a shop that you started sewing or you were doing it from home? Oh, okay, okay. Actually, uh, the first year when I came here, uh, I was, how to call it, I went to 
uh, buy suit mm. when I start first. Mm. I buy suit like a, uh, a number of suits mm. and then I start to resell it. Yeah. And then uh, four years ago, mm. I get one friend. Mm. So start, like, we can work together. Oh, okay. So we start working together and start bid like shopping and then start customing in the shop. Oh, okay. Do you just make suits or you make some other clothing or other things that uh, people wear? Okay, when, when I'm talking about suit, it's mm. not about only like formal suits. So, mm. like we make like young suits mm. and like uh, the, the suit for the old men as well. And also we costume shirts, we costume pants, we costume vest and the formal shoes as well. Wow. So it's all... It's it's all about classy to be classy to be classy yeah wow and then you sell out to uh, the people do you yeah. what is your target do you sell to only people in beijing or people in china or people in so, other countries so like my most target like where i'm selling a lot mm. is like abroad not only oh, okay. in china oh, okay because like uh my business is focused on online oh okay because like we we almost finished to build the website mm. and now we we already send like suit like on the base like example like i have the base in ottawa in canada mm. i have the base in michigan in the u.s mm. also i got base in uganda kampala mm. also i got base to congo kinshasa wow. so those base like my base like they would open shop and then like i send them and then also i'm selling it online wow that's nice you're doing very well yeah yeah but in bedding like we focus but in bedding we are not uh, like so famous mm. but we start we start like start from the bottom so mm. we can start where we start wow. like selling from we start yeah. so we start here and then like the global as well mm. well so as you can hear uh this is a gentleman from congo who is based in beijing china over here doing so well for himself he styles suits he does a lot of things and then he tries to sell to people across the world, not just in, in China. Now let's move on. Um, have you worked with some Chinese designers? Well, actually, uh, I'm the one who give everything. So I'm the CEO mm -hmm. of the design. Mm -hmm. I'm the CEO. So those that I'm like the engineer. Oh, okay. So I give the plan and then they do it. Oh, okay. So like all my suit is uh, designed by me. Oh, okay. So they are Chinese workers, they are only for merit. Oh, so okay. like I draw everything, I give them the measurement, everything, and then I just give them to do it. Oh, okay. So what you're trying to say is that you do the designing, everything, you plan everything, and then they, the Chinese people just have to sew. Yeah, so like... Make sure that they do it according to your plan. Exactly. Oh, okay. Okay. How, how does it feel? What is your experience working with Chinese people designing suits? But... I think it's like nice mm. and every, everyone knows like the, the Chinese workers that work mm. hard. Mm. So I think it's like that is opportunity for me. That's an opportunity. Yeah. So, let's talk a little bit about the market. Um, is, it, is it doing very well? Uh, do you focus on just Africans, just foreigners or both foreigners and Chinese or anybody can buy your suit? Okay, so let's talk about the business on the suit market. Mm. like. Most in China, mm -hmm. the people buy suits is the foreigners. Oh, okay. Because I give an example, Chinese can buy one suit for a one year, but oh, okay. foreigner can buy suit every two weeks. Oh, okay. Every month can oh, buy okay. at least one or two suits. Two suits. So that's why we focus on foreigners because oh, okay. they are the one who buy. And the most of people buy suit, they are people working in the embassy, like their diplomacy. You mm -hmm. see, mm -hmm. so that's why we focus on them and we talk to them. We interest them, we show them the new designer, we show them which one can match in the ceremony, mm -hmm. which one can match in the event. Mm -hmm. So, like, how we deal with them. Uh, so, you mentioned that, uh, for example, the diplomats or the people at the embassy, uh, you don't just sell the suit to them, but you also help them to style it. So, aside making the suits, are you a, can you call yourself a stylist that you style people on how to wear? I can call my, myself not only stylist, but I can call myself a designer and a stylist at the same time. Example, when some, uh, someone called me at home, mm. he told me I got events. Mm. So I tell him, like, show me what kind of events you have. Mm. So he showed me, I give him the plan. Mm. So you know this kind of event, 
you need to wear this kind of suit can help you to match with the event you're gonna have example on saturday wow so like i'm i'm selling them suit also i sell them my idea as well yeah yeah that's true yeah wow. that's nice you see here they put the kilogram the fabric mm, okay. so there's some like most of the customer from africa mm. they think like uh, the heavy fabric is good so oh, okay. i tried that wrong so the, heavy, oh, the the heavy fabric is the heavy fabric. Is, which which type is the heavy fabric? Is it a thick one? No, no. Is the you can see here. You see here. Oh, three forty grams. Yeah, but the, this one, the the light one. Oh, okay. So this one is good for summer. Oh, okay. So the heavy, the same fabric, but on the kilo it can be five hundred oh, okay. for the winter. Oh, okay. But for us in Africa, we need light one. Oh, okay. But when you bring in Africa light one, the thing is like, it's fake. It's, it's <laughs> not fake. The thing, the quality is bad. That's why they are wrong. Uh, so okay. we need to teach them like the 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 fabric mm. it depend on the temperature it depend mm. on the, the the season the season yeah. yeah you can see here we have so the here black there are a lot of colors yeah a lot of colors but they yeah. are, are they all the same yeah uh, no, the, 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 in terms of yeah yeah that's same that's the, same, because, the same yeah because in the book that's the put like all is like so this is the label yeah the label. all of them yeah yeah wow. let's see here as you can see so we're going through some of this fabric uh so many colors of fabrics we have here uh, you see all this fabric later. When we finish talking, we'll show you this fabric. You can you can keep them. Yeah, keep we them here. Yeah. Uh, when it comes to buying your suits, are the prices that expensive, or they are okay? Because this is China. This is not Africa. Um, people over here tend to spend more money. Do you think people like your prices are okay for people to buy? But the things like I give people good services, like mm -hmm. how. Like you can call me, you are at home, okay, and I go there. I get the measurement, and I made the suit for you at your home. Wow! So that that can be expensive because I traveled yeah, that's to true. your place. That's true. And then I get your measurement, mm. and then I think that the the price is not really expensive. It's not really expensive. Yeah. Okay. We'll be talking about the price later, but uh, let's compare fashion in China and that of Congo. Uh, in terms of wearing suits. When you came to China, you were already styling and wearing suits from, from Congo. Yeah, but it was, yeah. I can yeah, right? Like it was <laughs> suit, it was yeah, it, it wasn't much. <laughs> it was not much. But you but have an idea. Yeah, I got an idea yeah, like, since a long time. Yeah. yeah, that is Congo. Yeah, a lot Congo of people idea. are styling. It's like from the blood. From the blood, right? Yeah. When you came to China and you see the life over here, funnily, uh, unfortunately, not many people wear suits around like on a daily. Uh, how do you compare how people like patronage or buy or use suits in China to that of Congo? Okay, so when I come here, for Chinese, I can say that I don't wear suits a lot. But for foreigners, there's type of foreigners that always wear suits to the event. Mm. So it's like Congolese people. Wow. And like people work in the embassy. Mm. Because they work, they work every day, but with suits. Okay. So from that, I see my target. So that's why I got the idea, and that's why I got the idea to sell my product to them. Because mm -hmm. you need to sell the people who, who consume your product Definitely. every day. That's true. So you go like people walk into the office. The only former clothes is suits. Mm -hmm. So you need to focus on that target. Oh, okay. Okay. Fernando de, de Castel. Castel. Yeah. As you can as you can hear i think it's getting interesting and we are getting to know more about this brand fernando de castel how did you choose the name i know your name is fernando okay so uh you know one days when mm. i travel to to Taki, you know mm. Taki people because that's my business when i travel to taco i meet one friend he, he, he made his brand just fernando that was like a long time ago like three years ago yeah oh, okay three years ago he just made his brand Fernando. And I said, like, oh, you made your name Fernando? That's my name, like my <laughs> real name. But that guy's name is not Fernando. Oh, okay. He just made his name Fernando. When I come back, I was working to that brand like almost one year. Because mm. I was I was I was confusing to make like Fernando Malonga, Fernando Makasi. What and is Malonga? What is Makasi? Are they your names? So that means like strong. Oh, okay. Enough. That's a nice name. Though. Yeah, that Makasi, mm. strong enough. And then um, when I come back to Malonga, that means something like nice. Oh, okay. So, and then I realized like 
is the brown is not about the only people you can sell is your own people I say no I need to find some things can be interesting mm. so I put my name and the castle the same time mm. and then I bring it the castle mm. the castle means like something like new style shine like with more vibes mm. more energy mm -hmm. so that's the castle that the, the meaning of the castle the castle yeah it's like stylist name like you sleep and you wake up this name come to my head yeah, yeah. and then i put it yeah it's actually very nice the name fernando de castle is actually a very nice uh, working in china doing business in china what are some of the problems or challenges that you you face so right now we have problem about we don't have more foreigners mm -hmm. so the the business is going well but not like before mm -hmm. uh, but as i say like i'm not only focused in china but focused everywhere mm -hmm. in china those things only oh, okay yeah that's okay. challenging like challenging to make competition mm -hmm. and also the number of the foreigners because mm -hmm. the foreigners their main target like before there was the border was open like oh, so the virus the coronavirus yeah the coronavirus before the border, the border was open mm -hmm. like you can see like people like come like from a uh, delegation mm -hmm. like you can see like in my country the president come Maybe with 20 people behind. Wow. And there's 20 people behind that can call you. I need to make all of them the suits. Mm. So that was making like a lot of profits mm, yeah, and a lot of, mm. lot of money because of that. But right now, those kind of things is not like since two years ago. Mm. So this is challenging. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's true. So uh, as you know, he was the one who styled me. Uh, this is a beautiful suit he gave me uh, for the set and for me to take home. But then I want him to talk to you a little bit about this suit. What is the color combination of this suit? And just tell us a little bit about how to style this. Okay, example. Mm -hmm. Like you can bring your girlfriend like mm -hmm. in the restaurant Saturdays. Mm -hmm. So what kind of suit you can put? Yeah. You need to wear something like shine, like mm -hmm. shine a mm -hmm. bit, not like really, really mm -hmm. a bit. And you put the dark green silk. Mm -hmm. This one. It's okay. much so much mm. and you can see inside here the red the red color here mm. so you need to put like a formal shoes mm. with the red button oh, so okay. this is gonna match for the date so i want to ask you um <coughs> making the suit here how do you get the suit to the to the customers you mentioned like a, a website right is the website ready it's almost done it's almost done yeah so now if people order the suits maybe people from Beijing or other cities, how do you deliver the, the, the suit? Okay, so uh, first of all, people, if order suit, if it's not in China or in Beijing, mm -hmm. so I'm gonna send you, I'm gonna send him mm -hmm. the, the, the form he can fill up and then send back to me. Mm -hmm. Like the, uh, the form, he got all the thing he need, like the measurement, harm, waist, everything's kilo everything's mm. and then when you feel it and then i'm gonna send you some samples mm. like some uh sample already made it mm. or some design already made it mm. if you got if you don't have the it's on our designer oh, okay so some people like that don't know about suits mm. that ask you what what can i wear mm. i can suggest this one is good for you for your graduation party oh, okay or for your graduation like ceremony mm. so this one and just send me your your measurements. Measurement. Yeah, that's oh, okay. all. Oh, okay. And then after that, I ship them to them and then I receive it. Mm, okay. Do you think doing the, this business in Beijing is, is, is a good choice? Uh, I think not only in Beijing is a good choice, but in China in general. Because I'm not only doing it in Beijing, I'm doing it sometimes I move, travel to Shanghai, mm. I do it in Shenzhen, Guangzhou. I'm doing because, like, uh, uh, I'm not only do made to custom mm -hmm. but i'm also uh retail for like, like for for people want to buy for me and then sell them mm -hmm. also uh as i told you like i need to travel to get this base to send like this yeah so china in general is my business oh okay yeah okay what is the the future plan for fernando de castel branch so my future plan is like to challenge zara Zara. Yes, I want to challenge Zara. I want to challenge Zara, and why not to to beat me up? Mm. You know why? Because uh, 
Zara is, is the big brand, mm -hmm. and it sells a lot every year. Yeah. So I'm not only stay on the suit, but I can also do everything, but no now. Mm -hmm. I'm starting with the suit, and after, I will sell everything like mm -hmm. a formal glassing shop. Mm, okay, okay. Before I ask him of uh, the contacts uh, where you can reach him, there are, as you can see, there are some suits behind us. Uh, we have this that is green. We have this that is blue. I'm just going to ask him, where can we wear this suit? There is a gray one in, and then the, this is a green one. And the gray one. First, let's look at this green suit. If somebody has this suit, where can the person dress this? Where, where, which occasion can the person wear this? this suit? Okay, you see, this one is green, but mm -hmm. it's not like really, really like shine green. It's like mm -hmm. a bit darker, mm -hmm. like almost same with your color. Okay. This one, like this kind of suit is like for formal, like you go to the office. Okay. You go to the office or some no big party, like some small party occasion. occasion. So you can wear this kind of suit. This suit. Yeah. And then we have the gray in. This is like formal from the office. Like this for the office? Yeah, like most of this color, mm -hmm. people work from embassy like this kind of color. Oh, okay. This kind of gray. Oh, okay. So this is more casual? This is more casual. But this yeah. is more of uh, something that is a little bit higher? A little bit higher because the color. Mm -hmm. Because the color, most of the suit, suit depends on the color. On the color. The more color is strong, mm -hmm. the more you need to wear them like on the match to, the, to the, your events. Oh, okay. Example, if this one was really, really green, you can wear them at night. Maybe you go to the club. Oh, okay. Like mine? Mine is for the club and night. And date also. And date also. Yeah. Okay. Let's look at this blue color as well. This like this one? You yeah. can see this one is for, uh, you see this one is for officer. Okay. And also people work from the embassy like this kind of color. They oh, like okay. gray, they like blue, they like uh, blue sky, those kind of color. Mm. And also mm. they like uh, double breast. Double so breast, yeah. yeah. I was going to ask you about... The do so this is a double breast? No, 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 no. This is like, uh, that one is just a blazer. So oh, this is just a blazer. So the double breast mm. can be like this, you see? Oh, it extends a little bit. Yeah, it extends a little bit. So you can this. move like this or oh, you okay. can move like this. This, you yeah, see. Yeah, yeah, both is okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. I like this color a lot. My favorite color is blue. So next time I can order the blue, the blue one from Fernando <laughs> de Castro. The one I'm wearing, he gave me for free. I but gave him for free. Yeah, but... I need to make some others. So later, I will see him and make some others. And hopefully, he can give one of you as a, <laughs> a bonus <laughs> one. <laughs> if you buy a number of others from him, he can decide to give you one. For example, this kind of shirt you see here. Mm. You see the shirt, you see it's different like from normal shirt. Mm. This is like the normal shirt. We design it and then we want to make it like 10 star. Oh, okay. So you wear like this and then you put something here. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, it has a hole here, yeah, yeah. and then there's another one here. Yes, oh, okay. that, that new designer. Okay, so this is also designed by Fernando de Castro. Exactly. Wow. Made to wow. Castro. Made to Castro. Yeah. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's know where we can find you. If anybody wants Fernando de Castro to design a suit or want advice or wants any contract or anything, where can we find Fernando de Castro? Okay, right now you can find my, uh, my formation like you tap www.fernandodecastro.com mm -hmm. or you can follow me on Instagram, mm -hmm. Fernando De Castro, uh, Fernando De Castro Suits. Okay. Or when you go to the Instagram, you're gonna find all the information as well, like my phone number, you can link me on my WeChat, on my WhatsApp as well. Okay. So the, you go to the website first and you find me there, you're gonna go all the information, but the website still have the information, but you cannot buy yet. Oh, okay. Because we, we cannot order. We, yeah, we, we cannot order, but the other information is there as well. Oh, okay. So Instagram, uh, the website, mm. that's all. You can oh, find okay. me there. So okay. easy. All right, I'm gonna put all the uh, information that he just mentioned in the video, uh, the Instagram handle, the number, if possible, I'll the put number. it over there as well. Mm -hmm. So feel free to reach him out if you want orders for weddings, for parties, for casual, for work, anything. And if you don't know the colors, he can also advise you on the colors to choose. And then also about the sizing, feel free to contact him and talk to him. As I said earlier, this is Inside Businesses, where we talk to our 
uh, friends from other countries who live in Beijing and has been able to establish something for themselves. Today we had Fernando de Castel exactly. on the series and I'm very happy that he's here. And I must say, congratulations, you are doing very well for yourself. Thanks, man. Yeah, he's very popular, actually. He's very popular over here because of the good work that he does. So keep on doing the good job. Thanks. And then uh, I hope that you get more orders and I hope that uh, one day you will compete with Zara and then you will, win, and you will win as well. And Thanks I'll, you I'll for coming to me. And then I'll call you. You'll call me. I'll say I remember that interview. I will. And today's what I am. <laughs> I will come and meet you over there. <laughs> and then you need to give me my, my suit. <laughs> Thanks for coming on the okay. show. So we'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.